It's no wonder Southwest Louisiana is famous for its love of food. Boudin is one of Southwest Louisiana's favorite finger foods, and we are here at the Boudin Wars to see what the chefs are up to, especially if they have some secret ingredients to share. I'll also chat with event goers who will be voting for their Boudin of choice. Considered a staple snack in the southern regions of the Bayou State, Boudin is made of varying amounts of pork meat, liver, rice, onions, parsley, and dry seasonings like salt, red pepper, black pepper, and garlic powder. I'm here with Desiree, and she says they have quite a few flavors. What are the different types? We have regular, spicy, and smoked. And what's the favorite? Uh, we sell a lot of our smoked, but the spicy is really good if you like spice. What are the, some of the things people can do with boudin instead of, besides just grabbing it and eat it? What are some of the other uh, there's several There's several recipes that are out there. Uh, boudin balls is a pretty traditional uh, dish they do with it. A lot of people even do a boudin dip that's done with sour cream and boudin mixed together. Ooh, nice. Uh, and then what do you dip? What do you, you dip chips in there? Chips in it, yeah. It's, okay. It's just like a, a dip for chips. Okay. And any secret recipes that you might have at uh, Market Basket? Yeah, that stays a secret. Okay. <laughs> I hear some of the chefs are cooking inside the Henning Cultural Center. Let's go check it out. Let me see, which one is this one here? That's smoked. That's the best. Uh, yeah, everybody likes that one. It's the best. That really smells good. What's your favorite one? My favorite would probably be the smoked jalapeno. Smoked jalapeno, so you like it hot and spicy. I like it hot and spicy. Everybody seems to like it on the spicy side here in Southwest Louisiana, I notice. Johnny, you have quite a few different flavors, I see. Yes, we've got spicy boudin, we've got smoked jalapeno, okay. we've got mild boudin, also we've got crawfish boudin. Crawfish boudin? Crawfish. Is that this one right here? That's it. Ooh. Mind if I try? Try it. Mm. Tell me, how are these boudin balls made, Ramona? Well, you do them like you cook the boudin and stuff, and then you roll them up and fine. And tell me what's inside of these. Uh, it's meat, seasoning, and we have pepper jack cheese in it. So would this be considered a spicy boudin ball? Yes, it is. Okay. Yes, it is. What is this over here, Marie? This is a traditional boudin. It's a uh, rice pork and a little bit of liver. Do people eat it just like this, or do they add something to it, Marie? People eat it any kind of way. They'll okay. eat it with cane syrup. Oh, cane syrup. Ketchup. They'll just however you want to eat it. We're here at Boudin Wars talking to everybody. See what kind of boudin they like. Do you like spicy or spicy. mild? Spicy. 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 We'll get lots of spices. Spicy. You like spicy? If spicy isn't too hot for you, if it gets too hot, you got this little thing over here to wipe your forehead. You coming for some boudin too? Yes, sir. Oh, you like boudin. You like spicy or mild? I bet you like mild. So we like it all. When you're done sampling now, you're going to take the color and put it in the box, and that's how you're going to vote for your favorite boudin. Is that right? Yeah, that's correct. That's how we do it. And this is a very important table because what happens here? People get a chance to... Vote for their very favorite boudin. Wow. So wh whichever they feel is their favorite, they bring that right. color back here. Drop it in drop the box. Drop it in the box. And, and then it, we'll count them later and we'll have a winner. It's going to be a favorite boudin in southwest Louisiana right. this afternoon. You're right. I'm here with Alfonso and Linda and they're getting ready to try a whole bunch of their boudin to see which one is their favorite. Have you tried any yet, Alfonso? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I tried the white one. And how was it? It's really good. Is that the one that has the crawfish in it? Yes. Oh, I had that earlier. Oh, wow. Hey, for someone who has never been to Southwest Louisiana, what would you like to say to them? Eat more booty! We're here with some really nice folks that just grabbed their chairs and they're sitting down over here. Where are you folks from? Where are you from, sir? Houston. Houston, you came all the way from Houston to come to Southwest Louisiana's Boudin Wars. I did. It, I got, got a really wise person over there that says, this is worth coming to. Have you had Boudin before? I have, but not in so many different varieties. I didn't realize they made it so, so many different flavors. So you're glad you came from Houston to try this? I am. We have Kayla Miller over here getting ready to have some delicious boudin. What's your favorite kind, Kayla? Just a regular kind. Regular kind. And do you eat it, just grab it and just eat it? Sort of. You don't put anything on top of it. You just no, eat it. No, sir. Bought by the pound, boudin is a local culinary tradition. To learn more about the Southwest Louisiana Boudin Trail and Boudin Wars, visit www.visitlakecharles.org slash 
Food Awards.